Okay, this is something I've learned about painting. As you can see, I'm not good with painting, okay? When I paint, I have a lot of excess paint which always runs down within the pot. So, this is a journey I'm going through where painting is concerned, you see? It runs down at the side of the pot, okay? Makes it unattractive. But what I have learned, I've learned a new trick and I decided to share it with everyone where painting pots are concerned. Okay, so I'm going to turn the pot over. Okay, I turned the pot over and then I painted the pot. So when I turned it over, this is another one that I did. You see, it is perfect. No paint is running anywhere in the pot. Look at it. It's perfect. No trippings, no runnings anywhere. So what I did, like I just said, I turned the pot over. Turn the pot over, but in this I rest protection for the table. Okay, this is my work table. So I turn the pot over. This is a pot that I made, right? And I turned it over, as I said, and I painted the pot. So it did much better than the first pot I just painted. And as a matter of fact, all the pots I ever painted, this one painted a lot better. So I learned something. So I just wanted to share it with you all. How to paint a pot without having a dripping inside of the pot. You see? It's perfect. No runnings. So the dripping will fall on the cardboard or whatever you put on your work table. Instead of running down inside of the pot. So I hope you like my post. I hope you learned something too, like myself, and how to paint without having the paint running inside of the pot.